ATM Protection Solution Modular Armor Shield Base Assembly Open the box and spread out all the parts on a soft surface like cardboard or a blanket. Check that all of the contents are included using the part list that may be enclosed or otherwise is featured on the company's website. If anything is missing, please contact your supplier. The order of assembly is important, so please follow the directions in order. Throughout the assembly process, when using the carriage and plow bolts, make sure to push the head of the bolt into the hole when screwing the nuts on. If only the modular armor base is being assembled without a top part, a white closure strip should be connected according to step one in the instruction booklet. Pick up part number one. Pick up part number two and insert the protruding parts into place from above until the two sections are at the same height. If only the modular armor base is being assembled without a top part, a white closure strip should be connected according to step three in the instruction booklet. Pick up part number three. Insert part three on the protruding parts of part two from above until the two sections are at the same height. Place part four on the three assembled parts. Ensure that part four completely secures the other three parts underneath it. Take the door part seven and connect parts five and six to it by fastening nuts on the bolts. Attach the two hinge holders to the assembled door. At this point, only one nut should be screwed and fastened to the single bolt. Attach the door to the armor shield by fitting the hinges onto the remaining bolts and fastening the nuts on top of them. Assemble the lock protector on the door and on the armor shield as shown in the instructions. Make sure to place the short bolt into the lower right hole as shown in the instructions. Bring the two parts of the lock protector together and slightly tighten the hex nuts. The final tightening will be performed after the armor shield is attached to the floor before the machine is inserted. If you are also assembling a top part of the armor shield, please click here and pass to the relevant continuation video at this point. Place the armor shield in the desired spot. Drill through the bolting holes to the ground and to the wall if possible. Insert the appropriate bolts for anchoring based on the installation location. Bring together the two parts of the lock protector so that one fits completely into the other and place the lock into them to make sure they are in place. Fully tighten the hex nuts and, if possible, add short nuts on top of them and tighten once again. Place the machine into the armor shield and push it all the way back to the wall. Make sure you can easily open and close both doors of the ATM and of the armor shield. Drill through the holes at the bottom of the machine into the floor. ATM Protection Solutions 